Hello everyone, this is Pinoy ako Edit and I am Reynaldo Bad again bringing to you another brilliant idea about video editing. And today, I am using Camtasia Video Editor in response to the request on some of my YouTube channel subscriber. And in addition, I would like to give my appreciation to everyone for watching my videos. I will be uploading more videos in the coming days. Just click like and subscribe button in support to my channel. Okay, let's begin. Click call outs button. If you can't see text tab, click drop down menu and then click text tab. I am using Hobotex font and I am using 120%. Now drag corners of the text screen to fit to the main screen. The yellow lines represent the corners or the edges of the screen. Now I will type in my brand name, Pinoyako. Now I will extend this to about 20 seconds. Right click and copy. And then make a 7 pieces duplicate. If you can't see visual property tab, go to more. And you can see this one. Now click on visual property. Now click the topmost portion. It is on 0%. The seventh part is negative 3. The sixth part is negative 6. And then followed by negative 9. Then followed by negative 12. And then negative 15. And then negative 18. And negative 21. Alright. Today you will not only be learning how to make a 3D text effect and how to animate it. You will also be learning today how to make your video clip move faster or slower. Okay, now this is the original movement of the video before speed ramping is applied. It's in 100% motion. And here is the movement of the video after fast motion or speed ramp is applied. For the sake of this tutorial, I just added 200% speed in order to maintain the good visual quality of the video. Now I'll show you how to do this. Make an in point, an out point in your video clips. For me, I cut the video clips where I want speed ramp to happen. Highlight the video clips, right click on it, and click speed. The original speed of the video is 100%. I will just make speed 200%. If you want to make a slow motion to video, just reverse this process. And now highlights the remaining video clips to reconnect to the other. Alright, let's apply motion to the 3D text. Highlight all the text layer, right click and click group. Now go to more and click on visual effect. Now click add animation tab to add animation to the timeline. Now hold shift and control key on your keyboard and move screen to the movement you want to happen. Alright, now. Click the playhead animation on the timeline and move a little bit forward to make the movement of the animation a little bit slower. The longer you extend the playhead animation, the slower the movement of the text in the screen. Now, just repeat the process until you are done with the movement you want for your animation. And for the sake of this tutorial, I will make this portion a little bit faster.
okay as you replay to see your animation on the screen the movement might be a little bit sluggy but it's okay if you export it as video it will be fine and smooth for the sake of this tutorial i will export this video oh i forgot my fb page is in the background <laughs> well this is my fb page and this graphic design that i made was already posted on my youtube channel you can watch the tutorial about this on how to make a circular 3d text effect well these are some of the video clips that i made and scroll down a little bit this one is an intro video and this and this one is just a simple video clip okay let's go back to our work and i'll play the video i exported here it plays so soft that's it okay now what we're going to do is to save this as preset now right click and click add asset to library and then and then rename it let's save this one for future use and for the sake of this tutorial i added a quick view of my timeline in order for the beginners to know more or to have an idea about the layering of the video video effect video transitions and sound effect and okay that's it for now guys you have learned two techniques today the making of 3d text effect and how to animate it and how to apply a fast motion or slow motion to a video i hope you learn a lot guys with my video tutorial and if you are not subscribed yet to my channel can you click the like and the subscribe button and don't forget to click the bell so you could be notified if ever i will upload a new video in the coming days thank you for watching guys